us lesson 99 in Saxon's second edition, Algebra 1 half. And this lesson is on unequal quantities. It's a pretty uh, simple lesson. There's only a couple of example problems that we're going to do and then two practice. This is really taking what you already know how to do and just, you know, adding a little more to it, which is exactly, like I said in the last lesson or so, um, it, that's what math is. You build. You can't learn something then forget it. You learn it and then practice it and then build on to it. Okay, so we're going to take words and we're going to create a mathematical equation that we can solve out of those words. Now you're used to taking the words and putting them into um, some sort of equation. <clears throat> this just puts it more into a little word problem where you're actually solving for something. Example 1 says twice a number is 56 less than negative 72. What is the number? Okay, well we know that um, twice a number is two times that number. So we put 2 in. And then is means equals. Then we go, remember, to the end. We start at the end first. It is 56 less than negative 72. So what we really have is we're going to, we have the same sign, which means we're going to be adding. So we have negative 72 plus negative 56 is equal to negative 128. 2n equals negative 128. To get n by itself, we have to divide by its coefficient. And <clears throat> we'll do that on both sides. When we do, we see that n is equal to negative 64. Isn't that easy? Okay, example 2 says 6 times a number is 14 less than the opposite of the number. What is the number? Okay, well, let's, let's um, take this one little phrase at a time. 6 times a number would be 6n. 6 times a number. Is means equals. Now remember, go to the back. It is 14 less than something. So it is minus 14. What is it 14 less than? The opposite of the number, which would be negative 1n. You do not have to put that negative 1 there, but I find that for some people, it, it helps, okay? What is the number? All right, well, here I find that I have an n term on both the left and the right. I want to get them both on the left. So what I'm going to have to do here is add 1n to get that to cancel out. So I'll add 1n here. This is gone. 6 plus 1 is 7n equals negative 14. Then continuing to get n by itself, I have to get rid of 7. It's been multiplied, so I need to divide by 7. And I'll do that on both sides. That is gone. n is equal to negative 2. And negative 2 is the number. Okay, let's work our two practice problems. 7 times a number is 8 greater than the sum of the number and 10. All right, a little more words here, but we take it one step at a time. 7 times a number is 7n is 8 greater than. So we're going to add 8 to something. What are we going to add? The sum of the number and 10. All right, I got to get a sum of this and then I'm going to add 8. What is the number? All right, so here I've got like terms that I can combine. 7n is equal to 10 plus 8 is 18 plus n. I've got this n here that has to come down. Alright, now, I need to get this n 
over to the left hand side so I'm going to subtract n minus n I got rid of that and I have 7 minus 1 is 6n is equal to 18 then when I divide by 6 on both sides I'm going to see that n is equal to 3 all right let's do b 3 times a number is 15 less than twice the opposite of the number. What's the number? All right, let's start with 3 times a number. Is. It is 15 less than something. So I'm going to come over here and I'm going to subtract 15. What is it 15 less than? Twice the opposite of the number. And I'm going to write that like this, negative 2n because negative 2 twice the opposite of the number is negative 2n. Okay, so let's move. We have n's on both sides. We don't need to do that. So let's move this one to the left by adding 2 to both sides. Get rid of that, and we have 3 plus 2 is 5n equals negative 15 and when I divide by 5 on both sides I get rid of the 5 n is by itself n is equal to negative 3 all right good job I know that this is going to be a very very easy lesson for you and I will see you next time for lesson 100